Hello everyone and welcome to my channel. My name is Brittany and today I want to show you how to use vinegar for nearly everything. Let's get right to the video. I first start out by filling a water bottle with pure white vinegar. Vinegar is a natural disinfectant and the less watered down it is, the better it works. So as much as I can, I try not to water it down. In my kitchen, I love using pure vinegar to disinfect the countertops and my cutting board. I love the vinegar is safe to use around food, so it gives me the reassurance that I can use it right on the countertops and by areas where I prepare food. I also love to use pure vinegar in my bathroom to clean around the sink area. It's amazing how it can clean in the sink and really get tough grime to pull up easily because of its acidic properties. I often will use a toothbrush to get hard to reach areas and I will spray the vinegar directly on the bristles for it to clean the best. Here is a close up of how well the vinegar gets grime out of tough to reach areas. The sink looks so clean after it is scrubbed completely with vinegar. I add a little bit of vinegar into the softener spot of my washer to act as a disinfectant, as a softener, and to fight odors. Having a three month old with acid reflux, it's very common for me to get spit up on my clothing and the vinegar works wonders to get any odor out of my clothing, my children's clothing, or my husband's clothing. I think my favorite place to use vinegar is in my coffee pot. I use a 50-50 mixture of vinegar and water and run it through a normal cycle as if I were making a pot of coffee and it cleans the coffee pot so wonderfully. As you can see in this video, it removes a lot of grime and built-in coffee grounds that are in the coffee pot. Here is a close-up picture of everything that is removed from the coffee pot from the vinegar being ran through it. I then dump the water down my sink so that the vinegar can be used to clean my drains as well. After I run the 50-50 mixture, I also run a full pot of water to make sure all of the grime is completely out. And just like that, my coffee pot is cleaned. Here is also great as a non-toxic weed killer. I will say it does seem to take longer than a chemical weed killer, but I like to use it in areas really close to where my children play, such as around the sandbox. And as you can see, two days later, it does do a good job at starting to kill the weeds. Vinegar is also really great at cleaning off old window decals. Make sure to use a napkin to wipe off the window decals and spray the vinegar on the napkin away from the paint on your car because vinegar can negatively affect the paint on your car and you don't wanna get it on the paint. As you can see, the decal comes off very quickly and incredibly well. I also love using vinegar to sanitize my fresh fruits and vegetables. I use one tablespoon of vinegar per one cup of water in the mixture. I will mix them around and then strain them with a strainer and set them on a towel to dry. I love using vinegar to steam clean my microwave. I use 1 fourth cup of vinegar and 1 cup of water and microwave it on high for 5 minutes in the microwave. I then use a sponge to wipe out the microwave. It makes it really easy to clean out the microwave as everything is steamed and sanitized from the vinegar and water. 